today I want to take you through the process of how we trim and cut tomahawk steaks. So here we've got a lovely set of ribs of beef. We've cut them five ribs long. And the difference between this and a normal set of ribs, a normal set of ribs would usually be cut off there. These are actually beef short ribs. So what they've done to make the tomahawk, we've cut it longer, obviously, giving you long bone to get your, 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 your tomahawk action steak. This has been aged 28 days. I'll get straight into it, take you through the process. So I'll start by taking back plate off, which shouldn't be a problem at all. Good quality beef, this. Sauce from uh, Sandham's at, at um, Grimsby. We're just going to take it to the top of that, that point there, push that straight off. I'm going to take that plate off, then I'm going to take this back plate off of it. This can all be used and processed going into burgers. Meatballs, beef, 80 20 mince, all like that, should all be processed. Push your back of your beef short rib off, take this little bit of sport bone off. That's it. So you can see now we've got the basic process of phase one of the trimming is done. What I'm going to do now is take the bottom plate bone off, which is a simple process. In with the brecker. And as you can see, now we're getting the basis of a nice tomahawk. So, what I like to do is just trim these bits like this, and I like to trim the bone individually. A lot of butchers don't, I do. Got the basis of a tomahawk steak. Take this little bit of gristle out from under here, else every steak will show that little eyepiece in. So what we do, we take this out in one, This is actually the uh, like tendon that holds the cow's head up, a very strong piece. There's no way that would eat in your steak. So, once you've got your basic plate of your tomahawks, you cut them like this. Obviously, cut this one in just to show you, you see how different it make, and that'd be a, not a nice piece. Once you've gotten to this stage, I like to trim them individually for best effect. Get right behind that seam. You can almost peel it off by hand, it's such a good meat. Basically, just clean the bone up. And there we have the basis of a tomahawk stick. Dead easy, dead simple. I'll get all these cleaned up for the final picture. So we're left with the finished article. Prime quality tomahawk steaks, ready to be packed and delivered anywhere in the country from Bennett's Butchers Club, your local butcher nationwide. Tune in on Sunday to see what all the goodies we've got on the big Silver Sunday sale. Thanks for watching our video.